So I keep running into these, the same problem with these fancy desk setups. Like, I love it. Like, it looks so nice. But it's just, I don't know, it's just not, it's too formalized. Maybe there's a better way to do it. Computer, AirPods, oh, and the coffee. This is much better. I'm working on the exciting project, finally, of the builder's desk. But I'm going right now to check out one of these Equinox gyms. Um, why are they so expensive? <laughs> how people don't exercise it just it makes you feel so much better like I did a good workout steam and cold shower and it's just like it feels so good all right builders desk we're doing it I've got a huge plan that I've printed out from Claude like 150 pages um, but I just love this. Okay, so the internet is like the outside world behind your city. The router is city hall that makes all the decisions. The switch is the post office sorting center. The devices is the individual houses with the address. The network cables um, are the roads connecting everything. The Wi-Fi are the invisible bridges through the air. The data packets are the mail being delivered. The IP address are the house numbers. And the MAC address are the social security numbers, the permanent IDs. The firewall are security guards at the city gates, and VLANs are gated communities within the city. So cool. Okay, I'm gonna start connecting these things now. This is gonna be my server, which is gonna have storage and um, basically kind of cloud services for myself. I've just got keyboard and stuff here to plug in and play with all these things. I've got my actual backup here, which is an 18 terabyte uh, hard drive. The B-Link Sarah 8, which is gonna serve as the router the micro tick switch, some organization cables, a PDU, and then basically a, a safe power supply unit. So if all the power goes out, um, this will supply everything for maybe a couple minutes or something like that. So I love this stuff, it's so much fun. All right, I'm definitely doing something wrong. I'm literally hitting a wall. Cause I just don't know what to put in the phone. No, I'm an idiot, I'm an idiot. So this, okay, it's, first of all, it's just stuck in the freaking. it's three sixteenths, not three eighths. Idiot, 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 idiot. Well, time to drill more holes in the wall. Yeah. Thing took, only took me two hours. Should have taken like 30 minutes. On to phase two getting rid of this stuff on it. So far, this wood saw is the best, cheapest tool. I just used it to saw the felt off of these felt pads. So I added these felt pads. This will be really funny. Well, not so funny if I do all this and then it just all falls down. Okay, it's about six o'clock. I feel like what happens every day is I cause an explosion in my apartment and then I clean it up. But let me show you what I've done on this worker's desk thing. So here's the server, or the rack, my 19 inch rack. It's so overkill, but it's awesome. Isn't it awesome? Um, you probably figure out, out what this is. If you don't, this is a soldering station. Essentially, when you connect um, small wires or things like that, you melt a metal and it allows uh, electrons and current to pass through the metal that's soldering. Um, that's done with like little micro things, usually on computers and all this kind of stuff. But if you do it at a much larger scale, you can learn about electronics and circuits and build stuff. Um, this is a multimeter 
and that will help me measure the voltage and things like that across my circuits. This is a generator, so this is going to generate some DC, so direct current, as opposed to AC current, which is the alternating current. Um, so DC current is a little safer than alternating current. You can watch. There's this great. This, I think he's a really famous electric YouTuber guy. He blows up stuff. Please join me for the first time to hear how it sounds. And one, two, three, four. Um, I got some capacitors, got some tape, got some little tools. That'll be like a microphone and stuff like that that I'll put there. I'm gonna start to fill this, which will be another fun thing with all kinds of labels and stuff. And um, down here, that's what I'm gonna start to do is play with some Arduinos. Um, I really wanna build I've been thinking about building something for a while. Um, now I'm going to try to try to build it. But that is definitely the end of the vlog. I did go outside, though. I went outside. You saw. It happened. I was out. There was time. I have the monitor up here on a visa mount. I've got my server monitor here, and then I've got my data RAID NAS server here. And then I put up this picture of this frog. It's cool, right? Here's what it, is. it looks like from far away. Okay, it looks like a mess now, but I'm gonna clean it up. Uh, it's gonna look good.